Hi, my name's Randy. Uh, I'm from Leica Smart Projection, uh, based out of Germany. Uh, we're here at uh, ISC for our show. First time we're going to be exhibiting here. Uh, it's a new product. We entered the short throw, uh, ultra short throw projection market. Uh, we released this projector uh, last year in September, so this is the first time, like I said, we're actually at the show. So this projector that we have on show at the moment is the ultra short throw 100 inch projector. Uh, housed in uh, aluminium, it's the only projector on the market at the moment with the uh, motorized dust cover. Uh, it's 3000 lumens, uh, three HDMI uh, slots in the back with a, a, an ARC connection. Also there's a USB connection on the left which is a 2.0 and a USB connection on the back which is 3.0. Also this uh, unit comes with a TV tuner. Um, comes in three models, so there's an 80 inch model, there's a 100 inch model and a 120 inch model. The 80 inch version is not sold in the UK. Um, also as a full solution we have the spectral cabinet which is here. Uh, also comes with a Selexon screen in the back uh, connected into the actual um, cabinet. Now, this is just an option that we have for potential clients that want this projector, but obviously we're working with different um, cabinet manufacturers uh, around the globe to, for, for this product. Obviously, we've been around for 97 years. Anybody that knows, we come from the photography market, so we're renowned for our lenses. So this unit has our lens in there. It's a Summicron lens, has Dolby Atmos, Dolby Vision, with the left and right surrounding uh, speakers, firing speakers on each side. Two on the front, it's 50 watts. And obviously you can see from the brightness, uh, the picture quality that we have. This is running with an ALR screen. So this is an ambient light reflection screen. Uh, so this is good for daylight use. Uh, obviously you can use a matte white screen, but that would be more beneficial to be used in a, uh, a darker room. So that's about it from us. So if you need any more information, please go to Leica.com.